Senior living communities have been part of the high risk population when it comes to COVID-19. And that's why a few local facilities are still taking every precaution they can to protect that group. Our Ashley Gonzalez went out to both the Mirador Retirement Community and Palms Nursing and Rehabilitation Center. And tonight she shares how these places have kept COVID-19 away from residents. Throughout the pandemic, our most vulnerable populations were typically those in nursing homes or retirement facilities. And with COVID cases on the rise, two local senior living facilities are saying they're still doing their part to make sure residents and staff are safe over a year later. All right, 98.7. We'll check your temperature. We'll ask you a few questions about any possible exposure to COVID and we'll get you in our system as being a recorded visitor. And then we'll ask you to wear a mask the whole time that you're here. And if your temperature is higher than normal. If we need to, then we can do a point of contact test for COVID and then we will advise you from there. Unlike last year, vaccines are available, which adds another layer of protection for residents and staff, especially with most folks vaccinated. Of all of our staff members here, we're 72% vaccinated. Currently, our community is well over 95% vaccinated, so we're not even close to the level of having to restrict visitation. Administrators say what they've been doing so far works, and they are not going to stop anytime soon. Since January, we haven't had any uh, of our residents contract the COVID. Uh, we've had a couple of employees. Uh, they were caught through our screening process. They were sent home. They did their quarantines. They say they will continue keeping the health of residents and staff a top priority while still keeping watch of any more surges in COVID-19 around the community. Ashley Gonzalez, 3 News.